hey guys welcome back to technopanti channel so in today's video i am going to show you how to print messages by using different colors so here you can see the first line is printed uh, by using the red color uh, in which the text is printed using red color and the sec in second uh, line uh, the color is white but the background in the background we have green color so how to do this okay so this is the thing that i am going to show you in today's video uh, so basically this type of things are uh, very useful when you are printing the user logs logs for the user so it will be very useful for the user to understand that this is something that that is uh, that indicates the error and this is green means a uh, success message okay so the first of all let me show you something so these are the some escape codes that you have to use like this code is represents the red color this uh, code represents the green color so in similar way you can use different colors so in this example i am going to show you red green and yellow because these are the basic colors that we can use uh, to print user logs okay so you can use other colors as well just you have to find out the color code for them um, and then we have nc nc means no color you can use any variable over here it is not necessary to use red green or yellow like this you can use uppercase any combination you can use whatever you want okay so if you see here in red color this thing in all these colors this thing is common this entire thing this thing like 31 m this thing represents the color the actual color okay so this entire prefix is constant for all and this indicates the different color codes okay so 31 m means red 32 m means green 33 m means yellow and 0 m means no color that means whatever default color your uh, command prompt have okay so in most of the cases it is white only so 0m means no color so this is how you can use different colors and then one more thing that you have to remember that is 30 to 37 sets uh, foreground color okay that means only text color and if you use any number between 40 to 47 that sets background color okay so here suppose if you want to set background color then in that case you have to use 41 over here instead of 31 so if you use 31 then it will set foreground as red and if you use 41 then it will set background as red color okay so this is how you can use so let me show you how to use this okay guys so first of all let me uh, delete this file that i have over here and then let's create new file okay vi text color dot sh then i'm going to use these three color codes these four these are the variables in shell script like red green yellow and see this these are my uh, variables in shell script and these are the codes. this is how you can define the variables so instead of using this uh, codes directly in in the statement you can define variables and use them multiple times in your code now we have to use echo echo then double quotes and then variable name so which variable i want to use i want to use red so you have to use dollar and curly braces this is how you can like use variables in shell script so this this thing means i'm going to use this code over here so it will add this code over here and then type you can type any message for example welcome to technopanti okay and after that let's see what happened let's save this file and run okay so it is printing the code and message as it is so i don't want this i want this text message only with red color so what is wrong over here if you see we have escape over here and i am so that will add escape in my text message so whenever you have ex escape in echo you have to use hyphen e and then save and run okay so here you can see now it is printing the message in red color but the problem is it is printing this prompt also in red color so how to avoid this to avoid this we have to use echo hyphen e entire message after printing message i want no color so no color we have to use the other variable that we have defined that is nc okay and let's save this and run text color okay so here you can see it is printing this message and there is no color for 
my prompt so let's clear this and run this thing again here you can see welcome to techno Panthi. it is printing message in red color so suppose if you want this color in background so how to do that okay so to print messages uh, with background color let's add one more line over here so i will add something like echo hyphen e then my color name what color name so let's take green now dollar green and how are you okay and let's add nc that means no color so basically 32 represents green okay so let me show you first of all that it will print this how are you in green okay so i want this green in background so what to do as i told you earlier you can use number from 40 to 47 to set background colors okay so i want background color so i can simply change this 32 to what number 42 and if i run this again here you can see it is printing this message with green color in the background and suppose if you want red color in the background like this welcome to techno Bunti, this line uh, red color in the background in that case you can use 41 over here just add 41 and run this now you can see both these messages are printed using different colors in the background so this is how you can use these uh, colors in shell script to print logs user logs okay guys so here uh, basically i just want to show you one more thing so suppose uh, you have one more file log file uh, test.log which contains uh, user logs so for example suppose it is success so uh, so i will print some lines over here uh, your okay let me insert your script executed successfully then now you can close this window and blah 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 you can write anything okay so you want these all lines to be printed in the specific color for example if it is success then it, it should be a green color if it is uh, error then it, uh, it must be a red color okay like that so in that case what you can do just uh, this is separate log file okay so let me open this text color.sh uh, so as i told you uh, this color code will work with echo or uh, with hyphen e but here i want to print entire log message like log file that i have so in that case what you can do let me delete these lines and i want to print log okay cat test dot log so here, here you can't use hyphen e okay because it does not support to the cat uh, statement so instead of that what you can do you just let me show you this uh, the output of the text color dot sh so it will print entire message okay so i want this message in green color so what you can do you just have to add echo hyphen e and then dollar after that use variable your variable whatever variable that you are using so in our case i want this to be in green color so green and then after that use same statement with no color that's it so it will print entire message with the green and then at the end it will set uh, the prompt to the no color okay let's run this oh it is printing in uh, 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 green in background because we are using 42 over here so let me change this to 32 and let's print this once again yeah here you can see your script executed successfully now you can close this window blah 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 okay so this is how you can use the colors uh, to print different user logs in the shell script uh, by using these different 
color codes that you have and by using uh, foreground and background different combinations that you have uh, to use just to use different colors okay hope uh, this video is useful for you and you like it if you like just hit like button if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment section and please subscribe to the channel let's see you in the next video bye bye